Hey friends. So today I wanted to talk to you about sponsoring. Sponsoring, it seems to be a bit of a hard area for many people. Um, it hasn't always been easy for myself as well, but with trial and error and things that I've done along the way, I feel like it has become easier. Um, the main thing that I do want to talk about first when it comes to sponsoring is that you have to remember you need to be authentic. You need to make sure you are being you because one thing that I have realized along my journey, I've been with Sensi for almost four years, is that people join you for you because they love how you um, work your business. They see how you're working your business. They see your love for Sensi and that is attractive to them. Um, for example, when I have, I post about earning my trip to Mexico and I was posting how I got there because of Sensi, I, I got some new, I sponsored some new people because they saw what I was doing because of Sensi. They seen that I was having the best time of my life and it was all because of this business. So the thing that I want to make sure that I mention first is that you have to make sure that you are sharing your journey. I'm not talking about posting a flyer and and people running to that flyer that it, you have there's a join special this month and you're going to get some people that is not how it works i feel like with my journey a lot of people join me because they're coming to me they're coming to me because of the way that i share things it's because of how i'm offering things um i'm going to get into talking about the join host special or our the way that you can get a kit that way and get your newbies i'm going to get into all that but you don't have to run to them and you don't have to um yes you need to ask them and offer the join special to them but people also will come to you because of the way that you are sharing and they want to be part of something as well. Um, some people, they get super excited because they're bored and they see how much fun I'm having and that I'm making samples. When I'm making samples, I share it. When I'm doing something with Sensi, I share it. And I'm sharing it in not a salesy way. I'm sharing it because it's something that truly brings me joy. I'm sharing it because it makes me happy. And one thing that I have been told by many, many people is that they can see I'm very genuine when it comes to Sensi and um, it's very contagious. My positivity, when I talk about Sensi, they see that I radiate. They see that how they can see the passion behind my words. They can see that I truly believe in these products and that brings them in. It makes them curious as to why, like why does it make you so happy? Why does it um, bring you so much joy? It creates a mystery and it wheels them in and they wanna be part of that too. The positivity, I am told that all the time, that I just radiate Sensi, that I just, you can just tell with my words. Um, one thing that is very important in this business is that you need to make sure that you're using all of your outlets of your social media. And I'm not talking, again, I don't want you to think that you can post on Facebook about joining and you can post about buying this and this. I'm talking about truly sharing the product. And when, if you were to look on my Facebook and you were to scroll down, you're going to see that I very rarely talk about prices. I very rarely talk about buying this. I don't throw my link up with everything that I post because if they're interested, they're going to private message you. Um, I share things that I think are gorgeous, that I love. If you were to go to my VIP page, I share mostly personal photos. I talk about the opportunity. I talk about what Sensi has done for me. I talk about what it's about to do for me. If it's getting ready to, it, it, when it bought my truck, we bought a truck recent, recently. Um, I will enclose an income disclosure since I'm talking about money. Um, but when we bought our truck, I talked about how 
it would have never have been able to happen if it wasn't for Sensi. And I got to recruit that way. I got someone joined because of that post because I share. I am sharing what Sensi is doing for me. I am sharing all the things and that I don't even have to go looking for to sponsor anybody because they're coming to me because of these posts. But you need to make sure that you are doing it. You have to be willing to come out of your shell and be able, be willing to share your life with um, with your customers, with your people on Facebook in the media, in social media world. I'm not saying you have to share everything. I pick certain things that I am willing to let the world see. I talk a lot about my kids, school, my dogs, and then my sensey things that bring me joy. I put them up in my story. Do they see everything in my everyday life of what's going on behind closed doors? They don't, but we are naturally nosy people. We love to watch those talk shows and real life um, types things and people are interested and they do watch your stories. You may not get the likes in the comments. You may not get someone who you've had a joint conversation with. They may not join right away. But over time, I promise you, people are watching what you're doing and they will join you. You will randomly get someone who will be like, okay, I think I wanna do this because I, and I've been told by people who join me, they've watched me a really long time. And the fact that I am consistent, I've never given up, I do what I do and I'm pretty good at it. People are going to join you because you're be, you are successful. People are going to join you because of what you share on Facebook. Um, anyways, um, one thing that I do want to make sure that I talk about is that you don't always have to have a join special in order to get and sponsor new people. We have the host join kit that we have available every single day. Um, one thing that I do want to make sure that I tell you is that you never want to waste one of those kits if you have it unlocked. Never, never, never. Those of you who are brand new to us may not understand what I'm talking about right now. We have a host join kit where it you are able to have someone host a party, have an open shopping link, or maybe you have a catch-all party. Maybe you have a, a party that's open right now that says, fall orders or welcome fall and you have been collecting orders all month once you get to a $200 qualifying party you unlock this host join kit for it's a $59 kit and you can offer it to any of your um, potential teammates if you have someone who is hosting a party, you need to make sure that you offer the join opportunity to them and if for some reason they don't want to take advantage of that host join kit, then you need to make sure you are offering it to somebody else. You don't ever want to waste one of those kits. So if you say, for example, you have someone right now who has a $200 party, they are able to either buy and unlock that kit for $59 or that credit that they just earned for $20, you can apply it to that kit and it makes it $39. Some people think of the $99 join special and they get scared because that's a lot of money for someone when they don't know how well they're going to do with this business. And now the $99 kit is the best way to go. Um, you get a lot more stuff than the little, the smaller $59 kit, but it is definitely easier for them to jump on board with something smaller. So if they want to apply their credit to the $59, they're only spending $39. If they have a $500 party, they are going to be getting $75 in free Sensi credit and they can apply that to the kit making it free. Do you see where I'm going with this? So you can flip that party you, when I say flip, everything that you have manually entered into that party, you're able to turn over to them so whenever they become an, a consultant that they will get all those um, orders and they get started on the right foot. Um, and they got their kit for free, for free or discounted. Now, when I say, say they didn't want the kit, you can then start looking at your list of people and you can start offering it, hey, I have a kit that's unlocked for $39, are you interested? Or I have unlocked 
one of my um, party hosts unlocked a $59 join host kit. Are you interested in um, diving in? Because it is the fall and winter season. This is the best time of the year to join us um, because everybody loves the stuff. The stuff sells itself. Um, now, if you find someone, then you have to go in there. You have to change them as the host. The host will still get all of their goodies, but then the new person that you change to the host to get the kit gets the starter kit. When it gets to all the things, um, when if you found someone and you need to make sure that you're doing all the things correctly, please reach out to me, private message me. I will walk you through. I've done it so many times now to where it, it's scary until you get the hang of it, but it, there's a way to do it. Um, I always have a party link opened, always. And whenever someone orders, they can just, it, it's a catch-all party and it just orders, uh, orders fall into there. You should never, never close out a party link unless you've offered that to somebody. Either you are posting it on your VIP page that you have an unlocked one kit for such and such amount of money or maybe your party link is over $500 and it's actually free. Make sure you are offering that kit to somebody else because what is $20, $30 in Sensi credit worth to you versus maybe potentially getting a new teammate and giving them that Sensi credit to go toward their kit? Don't be selfish. You will make more money in the long run, as you build your team, as you get a bigger front line, make sure you are giving them the best opportunity to start. Maybe someone has some really hard times. They really just don't have the money. Make sure you are offering them a chance to earn some money for Christmas. Do not close those links out until you have someone who wants that. Now, if you're just posting it on Facebook, please don't think that, oh, well, I can't find anybody who takes who will take this. You need to be having conversations with people. You need to be planting those seeds. Um, there's different ways that you can plant seeds. I Last um, season, I made five dream boxes. I picked out five people who I thought would be absolutely amazing and an asset to my team. People who I thought that this business would bless. Maybe they were a stay-at-home mom. Maybe they just really had that personality. Maybe it was someone who um, are just down on times right now and they're having a really rough time and I knew this business could be a blessing. Five. I sent out five boxes. Four of them joined. Four of them joined. They joined me because I made these boxes and I glorified Sensi. I put all the things in there that makes me happy or what, when I think of Sensi, what things that I think of, I stuck a lot of, I stuck some samples in there, but I, I stuck other things in there, like things that, that are just happy and fun. I put some information in those boxes. Um, to show my journey, my why, and everything like that. And eventually, as I had the conversations with them, I followed up with them. Hey, did you get the box? Um, the one girl who did not join says she is going to join, but she wants to wait until she's done um, nursing school. So that, is, that isn't a no. That was, okay, she's still on my list, and I will keep going back to her until she finally joins because she wants to join because she has watched me and has watched my journey, and because they know me, they know that I'm no different than them. I'm no one special. I'm just someone who has a little bit of hustle and goals, and they're watching me, and they know that if I can do it, then they can do it, and that's why it's so important that you are sharing your journey. You cannot be afraid to post about what Sensi has done for you. You can't be afraid to share the opportunity the opportunity for people. Like people are going to join you for you. They're going to join you because you are successful, you are being consistent, and they know that you're not going to go anywhere. If you were to um if they had a choice of somebody else or myself and this other person was in and out, you she would go three weeks without posting, talking about Sensi. She um 
didn't return messages very quickly or or whatnot, and you compare the two, and you're gonna have someone think, okay, should I join Jen? Who is there, always there, loves her job, she loves her team, she's always, she shares how much fun she's having, or the other person who's only there once in a while. Who do you think they're going to choose? They want to be with someone who is successful. If you only show up um, when you want to, it is going to be harder for you to be able to get and sponsor your some new teammates because you right now are basically selling yourself. You are putting yourself out there. You are, um, um, you really need to think about how when people think of Sensi, how do they think of you? Are you a hobbyist? Are you in it? Because that's what attracts people to you. Um, remember, if you don't get much out, sponsoring doesn't have to be hard. Sponsoring doesn't. Sponsoring should be super easy. Now, am I saying I'm the best at sponsoring? No, I will go months and I don't get anybody, but then when I do sponsor, I sp sponsor a ton of people. But I'm continuously um, planning planting seeds with people. I mention it. If you know someone who is buying Scentsy all the time, these are the people that you need to be having those conversations with. They might as well getting, be getting paid off of their own purchases. If you watched my Sensi Club training that I did yesterday, guys, same thing. If you have someone who's clubbing with you, they need to get paid to club. When their club starts getting up to be around $80 to $100, you need to start having those conversations. And let me tell you the, these golden nuggets. If you do not ask them and you're not planning these seeds and you're not talking to them about joining your team, somebody else is. I've been there. I have done that. I have thought to myself, oh, this person would never join Sensi. She is too good for Sensi. She would never do it. Let me tell you, if you judge people before you even ask them, you are only doing a disservice to yourself because they will join somebody else. It has happened to me. Someone who I never thought that would ever think twice about joining Sensi joined, but they joined under somebody else because I didn't ask them. And I want you to know, if you don't ask them, I promise you, I will ask them. It is not that I'm trying to step on any toes, but I have the conversation with everyone. And you need to make sure that you are planting these seeds with everyone because it is all, I mean, that's just how I am. I love Sensi so much and I want everybody else to be blessed with this opportunity as much as I have. This, this business has changed my life in ways that I never thought was even possible. So I want this for everybody else. But I promise you, if you are not opening your mouth and you are not talking to people about the jo uh, join opportunity, I promise you somebody else will, somebody else will sponsor them because they're going to be watching you. They're going to be seeing how well you're doing, but because you never had that conversation with them, you may have turned them on to possibly joining, but if you aren't the person to ask them to join, somebody else will and someone else will snag them. And I'm telling you right now from experience, it has happened to me so many times until I realized I have nobody else to blame but myself. Nobody else to blame because I didn't. They were brave enough to actually ask and to make that conversation, I wasn't because I judged it first. I judged them thinking that they were too good for Sensi. You never know who would love to join you. Some people just want it as a hobby. Some people just want it as something to keep their mind off of things. Some people need the money, so they're joining for money. People join Sensi for different reasons and we cannot judge their situation for them because if we do, we will only hurt ourselves. Anyways, that is all that I have when it comes to sponsoring. Sponsoring is what you make of it. You need to make sure that you're always, always thinking about who this business can bless. Make sure you have a list of the people that you really want to have on your team, your dream team list. Have them. I have people on my list that have been on there for years, for years. I have people who have watched me for three years and finally joined. All you have to do is update this and just keep a note to yourself why. And when they do turn you down or they say not right now, make sure you jot it down why because they will eventually. 
Anyways, I hope this helps. We're getting ready to go into a really wonderful um, new, our, our, our best season of the year. And this incentive is off the chain. We have many different choices when it comes to the trips based on our points where it has it. You don't even have to take the Alaskan trip. trip. If your points are good enough, you'll be able to choose from the other ones, Norway and um, whatever the other one was. And the top 75, the Netherlands. I'm telling you right now that you can do it. It doesn't matter where you're at in this business. You can earn it as long as you start putting your head down and you start thinking about how you're going to earn it. The lower you are in title, the easier it is for you to earn a trip because you have so many sponsoring points. You have so many promotion points you have your prv points to earn your consistency points even when it comes to prv this trip is set up for all of you guys to succeed and i really want to see this happen i want you guys to take as many of you guys with me on this trip as i possibly can because i'm telling you right now i may have not earned it yet because it hasn't started yet but i'm claiming it now I'm claiming this trip because I never want to miss one of these opportunities again. Once you go on a Sensi trip, you will never want to miss the opportunity ever again because we can't do what they do for us. Yeah, I could take an Alaska trip. I could go to, to a trip to the Netherlands, but they go so far above and beyond and have connections and do things for us that I would never even be able to do for myself. Anyways, um, if you have any questions, please reach out. Um, we're better together, and I want to make sure that you guys have all the resources, all the pep talks, and all the things that you need in order to make things happen. Um, anyways, I hope you guys have a good day.